Welcome to Don P. Cooks. Let's go make some fried chicken. Let's start out with three and a half to four pounds of fresh chicken wings and add extra virgin olive oil as a binder so that the seasonings will stick to the wings well. Now we get into our seasonings and we have garlic powder, we have Cajun seasoning salt, we have garlic seasoning salt, we have paprika, we have black pepper, we have a seasoned three blend pepper, we have Italian seasoning, we have smoked paprika, and we have onion powder. We're gonna add one tablespoon of each one of these to our chicken. And make sure that you mix it up really good so all of those seasonings get evenly distributed across all of the chicken. Take your time. Now that we've got that, we're ready to move on to our flour mix. We're gonna go with one cup of flour and one cup of Italian breadcrumbs. I like the breadcrumbs. It gives it a nice crispy crunch. Let's mix that up evenly and let's add more seasonings to our flour. This is a very important step, very important. Now let's add our chicken and mix it all up. Get our chicken nice and coated. That's looking beautiful. I love to use cast iron skillets for my fried chicken. I feel they cook really nice and even. Let's add some oil and start dropping the chicken in. Do not drop the chicken in when the grease is too hot. You'll burn yourself. Listen to that beautiful crispy fry. Yes, Lord. Now, leave it in on one side for about five minutes and then you're gonna turn it for about five minutes on the other side. Now we go to the air fryer. We're gonna put this chicken in the air fryer at 400 degrees for roughly about 12 minutes, but you're gonna need to check on it about halfway just to make sure because these air fryers cook fast. Let's check our chicken. Looking nice, looking nice. I want it a little bit more crispy. You could take it out now if you wanted to, but I like mine a little more crispy. Few more minutes should do it. Yes, sir. Yes, Lord. That's looking delicious. My goodness. Add some potato salad and macaroni and cheese, and that is Southern fried chicken at its finest. Follow me for more recipes. I'm out.